Hello Grade 12s, the purpose of this video is to take you through the memo of your assignment on higher purchase agreements. So question one is about Tabohu who wants to buy a Golf. He approaches his bank to see if he's able to finance the car. The bank proposes the following higher purchase loan option to finance the Golf. And there is a monthly payment of 10,000 Rand 274. How does that come about? It comes about with an interest rate of 7%. The cash price of the vehicle is 671,190 Rand. There are 72 installments. He needs to make a deposit of 10.4% of the cash price. And there is an initiation fee, which is a once-off fee of 1,210 Rand. And there is no balloon payment. So question 1.1 asks, calculate the deposit amount on the vehicle price. Now we know where we got that from. I've just mentioned it to you. Your deposit is 10.4% multiplied by your initial cash price of 671,190 Rand. So if you work that out, you get a deposit of 69,803 Rand 76. Question 1.2 tells us that Tabojo is going to take this loan and we must use all of the information which has been given to us to calculate the total cost of the car. Now remember your total cost is going to be your repayments because your repayments all 72 of them include your interest payments plus the initial initiation fee um, and plus your deposit so those are the three components that are, going to, that are going to make up the total cost of the car so what are your repayments we know that there are 72 of them 72 installments and the monthly installments it's been told to us um, is 10,274 Rand per month. So we're going to be making 72 of those. Our initiation fee, we've been told, is 1,210 Rand. And the deposit, we've just worked out in 1.1, 1 .1, is 69,803 Rand and 76 cents. If we add all of this up together, um, first of all, our total repayments amount is going to be 739,000 uh, 728 rand if we add all of that up together we will get a total cost of the car of 810,741 rand and 70 question 1.3 asks how much more will it cost to Bojo to buy the car using this loan option compared to paying cash so we've just worked out that the loan option is going to cost us um, 810,741 rand so that is um, what we're going to subtract from so this is our answer from question 1.2 then what is the cash price again the cash price we've been told is 671,190 so that is what we're going to subtract from the um, total loan price and it will give us a total difference of 139,000 five hundred and fifty one rand and seventy six cents so that that is the answer to this question um just for interest sake i thought it would be interesting to show you um this hundred and thirty nine thousand rand um that you've worked out is what you're going to pay extra or tabojo is going to pay extra if he takes out the loan that works out to roughly twenty percent of the cash price of the car so if we take out a loan, rather than buying the car cash, we're going to pay roughly 20% more than if we had paid cash. Next up in question two, we've got Jenny who wants to buy a generator for her business because of load shedding. And there are two options. She can buy for um, 11,750 Rand, VAT inclusive, um, or on cash, uh, rather on higher purchase for 564 Rand over 24 months. That's option one. Option two is that she can pay 9,950 9, Rand VAT exclusive or on higher purchase at 448 Rand for 36 months. So notice we have got differing terms of our high purchase options here. And you are reminded that VAT is sitting at 15%. So let's have a look at question 2.1. Determine which option offers the best cash deal. Support your answer with calculations. 
So option one's cash deal, we already know. Um, it's been given to us is 11,750 Rand cash um, VAT inclusive. Option two, our cash price is 9,950 Rand, but that is excluding VAT. So we need to add VAT. And you should know that that is um, calculated by multiplying by 115 over 100, where that 115 refers to the 15% VAT. And we get a total there for option two of 11,442 Rand 50. So it is marginally cheaper than option one, which means that option two offers the best deal and that is the one we want to use. Next question, how much more will you pay if you buy the generator in option one on higher purchase instead of paying cash? So we are comparing the option one prices of a cash price of 11,750 versus the higher purchase of 564 Rand over 24 months. So we take that 564 Rand and we multiply it by 24 months and we will get a total price of 13,536 Rand. We then subtract from that the cash price, which is 11,750 Rand, and we get a total difference of 1,786 Rand. That is how much more we will pay on higher per Your last question, give two reasons why option two seems more attractive than option one and discuss the validity. Well, firstly, um, your cash price of option two looks much less. Um, it is 9,950 Rand, but the important thing is that that is VAT excluded. However, we did work out in question 2.1 that even with VAT included, option 2 is still marginally cheaper than option 1. The other reason that option 2 looks more attractive is that it has a longer term of its higher purchase because you can pay it off over 36 months rather than 24 months. Um, and because of that, the monthly installments are slightly